Hey everyone, welcome to another Roblox video. I, this is part 11, I believe. Uh, we're going to be continuing off from our um, Game Pass video of last time. So last time, I believe we got it so you can click this and purchase it. Um, but you can't actually, you know, do, do like, it doesn't actually give you a boost. I assume, I do say assume here. Um, we've already got the, uh, thing, so bear with me here, I believe we already have the game passes, go to game passes quick, no, okay, yeah, oh no, we do, sorry, yeah, alright, cool, 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 um, Do we? I'm just trying to remember what we got off to last time. Do we have the uh, thing? No, okay. So this video is going to make it so it actually gives you the stuff. So we need to go over to our leader stat script and drop down two lines. Let me zoom in a little bit here. We're going to be typing in local points, because obviously we're doing points for everything. You don't need to, it's just easy when it comes to saving, really, to be honest. Um, equals instance dot new, and then rather than doing int values, we're going to do a bool value here. So we're going to do bool value, and we're going to do one for our two times game pass here. So then we're going to drop down and say points, oops, points dot name. And we're going to set that equal to, and if we're here, we're going to say double pass, because it's our two times game pass. Next, we're going to say points dot value. We're going to set to be false at first. And then we'll say points dot parent is equal to the player. This makes sure that it's inside the player. Basically, this is going to, when this turns true, that's how the game's going to know you've bought the game pass, basically. I'll say we'll make another one. Actually, no, we won't. We we'll just copy this. Control C, drop down. Control V, or if you're on Mac, I believe it's Command C and Command V. But I'm not sure. I just, I'll just do that and then right click and copy, and that does the same thing. And then the same with right click and paste. Anyway, this is going to be another ball value, and this is going to be our triple pass for our three times game pass. Once again, false and player. Drop down, copy and paste the same thing, and this is going to be our double uh, prestige. I believe we've got that, don't we? Yeah. So this is going to be what allows us to do two times prestiges. And then after we've done that, um, we want to go and create a brand new script, which I'm going to make now. So go over to your server script service, create a brand new script, and we're going to rename this script to give perk. Uh, to rename it's right click and uh, rename or you can just press F2. I don't know what it is on Mac and stuff like that, but yeah. On Windows it's F2. I'm gonna say game.players.playerAdded, colon connect, uh, and then function player. So basically when the player joins the game we're gonna call this function here. So if game colon get service then here we're going to do marketplace service service this is where we get like our game passes from colon user and then owns game pass oops async um and then here we're going to need to get our ids um colon user owns game pass async you want to make sure you got all that spelt correctly otherwise it won't work player dot user capital I, double case D, and comma, and then here you're going to get your, uh, this is going to be the double, two times game pass, you're going to get your two times game pass, um, badge thing, which I believe we've already got, but I'm not sure, I actually don't know, so hang on a minute, let's go down to our starter GUI, game pass shot, uh, G shot, Oh, it's here. So our speed game pass. So two times, and then boom, paste that there. 
and then um I will say player dot double pass dot value uh equals and then true so once again as i said earlier this sets it to true so this confirms that they've bought it then we'll copy this and paste this twice here this will be our free time speed game pass so put in the id for that and then this one down here will be our double prestige and then rather than here we'll say uh here we'll say triple pass and then here we'll say double Double, um, that's prestige, I think so. It was true, and then after that, basically, it's done. Um, we can actually try and run that now, but I don't know if anything will work. No, obviously, it won't, will it? Um, so next, we need to go to events and put it in there. This bit's going to be a little bit harder, so where we've got our plus value here. Here under this we can say if player dot um no we're not sorry we're gonna say if player dot uh double pass dot value is equal to oops this is uh equal to true so I can't spell then uh and then here we're gonna say player dot leader stats uh dot points dot value plus equals one so this just adds another one. Oh yeah and then if you want you can do plus and then rebirth value which makes it even more OP because then if you've got say you have zero rebirths then it's gonna add two um and if you have two like two one rebirth then it will give you three if it's like this so it'll double your original one step plus the number of re like and more rebirths um however you could add this here to the end of this and then it will give you if you have two procedures then it will give you your original two plus two times your prestige value, which I don't, it's quite overpowered that. So, I recommend you don't, but you can if you want. And then here, once again, we'll say if player dot triple pass dot value is equal to true, then here we'll say player dot leader stats dot points dot value is equal to no plus equals and then three because obviously you're doubling it aren't you although having said yeah no no that should be right the maths there might be a bit off like you might want to do that at plus two because then you're getting your original Yeah, this is a bit off, so that's plus one. No, you don't, you just want that plus three, yeah. As you can say, once again, you do your little leader stats thing if you want, which I won't. Here, we're going to do, say, um, on the server event, then we're going to say, if player dot double prestige dot uh, value is equal to true, then say player dot leader stats dot prestige dot value plus equals one that just adds another prestige and I think that's it let's give this a go so it should we try one at a time so we should start off All right and that's just not working at all any errors no oh no it just wasn't loading in yeah so let's wipe everything quick so let's say under our, under my data store i'm just going to wipe my data store by going up here i'm going to call this tutorial 2 that will basically just reset my data store i can always revert it by going back to tutorial but i'm not going to do that here we are so 
yeah, now it's giving me five every time because basically, let's purchase this, it says already owned. So what's happening, I'm owning the two times speed, which means every step I take, it's giving me two, plus the triple speed, which is giving me an extra three, which is five, five every step. Um, actually, yeah, let's quickly try, um, the prestige as well. So we'll probably actually get to prestige in no time at all, to be fair. Uh, let's just try and get there. I don't want to type in commands because it just takes too long. Uh, we'll get there in a minute. If we can get to this orb. No, I'll just type in a command because it's quicker. So game dot players dot e circuit three three six dot uh, leader stats dot points dot value equals one thousand one hundred. And now we only need thirty more points, so let's just get those quick. Right, now it should give us two rebirths. One rebirth. Um, oh, it's because this is rebirth. Dot rebirth, dot value. Would you like to? See? Yes. Is it dot rebirth or dot rebirths? Let's check quick. Oh, it's dot rebirth. So, sorry, I did dot prestige. Because I'm thinking of my old games. This is dot rebirths. And then this should now work. So F9, here we are. So for instance, dot leader stats dot points dot value equals one thousand one hundred. Boom. And now I'm getting six because we've got this extra rebirth which is adding one. Anyway, uh, obviously I need to get a few more points than that, don't I? That's what I need to do. Probably the stats dot points dot value plus equals a thousand. Now if I just get 40 more points. Uh, and then this should go from one to three. So it should go us two. Yes, and also it does. Let's go. Um... I don't know too much about these gems to be fair, so but yeah, it's all working really well, so that's cool. Um right now I'm just gonna launch this under the local server of two players. Well, I don't know because these should not have the uh, thing so let's get all that it should go here and it should prompt it yeah if i put items i've been sold obviously because you can't buy it but and then yeah it prompts it which is really awesome so it works let's pause that in fact actually close that close that clean up awesome um so that's literally this video. So next video, I think we're going to work on the actual first shop upgrade. Um, so see you then. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm just going to file, publish to Roblox, so saved, and goodbye. Uh, see you in the next one.